Hello everyone, this is Real Talk with Coach Sherry. Thanks for tuning in. Please be sure to like and subscribe this channel. I am going to be doing a new video every day for the month of April. Today is April 2nd and we had crazy weather. Did you experience crazy weather too? Oh my goodness, here in Charlotte, North Carolina this morning, it actually snowed. It was like heavy, you know, flakes coming down and everyone was just so amazed at it because we've been having beautiful, amazingly beautiful spring weather. But, you know, today we had the snow flurries. Um, it stuck while it was coming down, but it didn't last. And the weather actually, the temperature has gone up. So um, I'm excited for my interns. They are getting some great opportunities. I mean, they're getting skilled up. They're showing that they're eager to, eager to learn and they're quick learners and um, they're learning some skills that's going to definitely transition them to other careers. Um, so far, at least four of them, I know want, um, where they're at, the areas that they're in, they want to actually retain them and keep them and hire them full time. So that's a great, great thing. Um, we're going to see how, you know, how it works with them for that. You know, taking initiative is such a huge deal, especially now, um, in this 21st century, so many employers, that's what they want their employees to do is to take initiative. Taking initiative doesn't mean that, you know, you do something that you don't know what you're doing. And so you, you're finding yourself asking all these questions. No, taking initiative means you're sitting back, you're looking, you're assessing the situation. You, you know what you can do to help that situation and you do it without being told. Um, I know someone who thinks taking initiative is just doing something but not even really knowing what they are doing. So for every step they take while they're doing it, they're asking, you know, for advice or is this the right move or is this the right thing? They don't just trust themselves. And that's another thing. When a person takes initiative, what you're really doing is trusting yourself and your abilities and your skills. And you really have to trust yourself no matter where you are. If you're entry level, you know, mid-level, advanced level, when you get into something new, the only way that you're going to get better is to step out and just do it and um, believe in yourself that it will be done correctly. Um, you know, this workforce, we cannot afford the the employee of the old, the ones that had to be told, all right, I need you to do this next. I need you to get that next. People, employers are finding themselves not having as much um, patience with that type of employee anymore. And so oftentimes those employees will be the first ones let go. So for this tip today, just take initiative, do what you can, do it well, um, and always learn. Be open to learn something new. This has been Real Talk with Coach Sherry, and I hope you have a great rest of the day.